Being a parent at the Cheder, I couldn't be happier. Knowing that my kids have a place to go to every single day that they feel is an environment like home, there is nothing that makes a parent happier. The Cheder is a Jewish day school that gives you a full Jewish education and a full general studies education flavored and infused with the outlook, attitude, and approach of Chabad Hasidus. So there's an incredible passion and excitement for Judaism. Uh, every day is a holiday over here for real. Every day is a Yom Tif where, where there's a lot of excitement that is infused and that is like the bottom foundation of everything and how we approach everything. The drive is 55 minutes each way and it's worth every single minute. Many people ask me, wow, your kids, you know, schlep or they drive, they go so far to school. So why would anyone in their right mind pick up and drive over an hour away to send their kids to school? And the answer is there is something that you have here that you will not get in any of those schools that are 10 minutes from our house. Okay, we drive like over half an hour and it's worth it for me because my son is able to learn according to his level with his teacher and just really get that one-on-one -on -one attention where I know that his needs are being met. The individualized attention that you get in this school transfers over and allows the kids to learn in a way that you cannot pick up on in any school, in any classroom that has 30 or 20 kids in a classroom, even 15. Most of the classrooms here are under 10 kids a classroom. And the individual attention that my kids get is unparalleled. So I feel very blessed that our children are getting an incredible chenach, very pure, very real, from wonderful role models. And the classrooms are very small. So the kids are getting a tremendous amount of attention. The teachers that have enough time to go over to them they're having an issue, they have the time, they have the patience because they're not overwhelmed by 36 or 24 or a large classroom. Whenever, like say you need help making something and you always try and you can't get it right, they always are there to help and they don't make you feel bad when you don't know something. They honestly are just very nice and they make you feel that you are like the main thing, that you're the main focus, that you're happy, that you're enjoying what you're doing and that you don't feel bad. Because our cheder is very small, we're able to actually zero in on every single individual child's needs and try to give them the support that they need for them to be successful. We're all a family over here because we're small and we have the time and ability to really focus on each child. The kids are any little talent or gift that they have, they're able to express. The school's like a secret that's hidden from many people and I think if more people knew about this incredible school they would take advantage and join. This cheder is really unique in a way that everyone's a family here. Everybody knows everyone. As a teacher I feel like because there are smaller classes you're able to like get to everyone. I'm teaching in the way that very very based and focused on to know how to learn by yourself. In a larger school, since you're not able to focus on each one individually, so you're not able to give them all the tools how to learn properly. Because the school is a smaller school, we're able to give them everything that they need in a way that it fits for them. The biggest reason why we do come here is the attention that there is here to each child. We do whatever we can and above and beyond, making sure that no student will be left behind and everybody should grow in his way. It's amazing that each child is taken care of very individually. There's no such thing as go with the flow. Every single child has more space. Everybody knows each other. We know each other by name. We know something about each other. Nobody's anonymous. And I, I think for the, a child, it makes a big, big difference. In this school, like everyone's like making sure that your child will succeed. So when I look at a teacher, I of course look at their experience and you know how they've taught in other places, but I'm also looking for passionate educators, for teachers that really care about the individual, about the child, that are not here to teach books, but are here to teach children, and that will be on the same page with me to help our children grow. Classrooms are supposed to be vibrant places. It's not supposed to be lectures. A classroom is supposed to be a place where children are touching, feeling, exploring, thinking, creative, um, peer sharing, working with each other. And that's what our classrooms are like. My goal is to make Chomish fun because Tyra is like your life. If they love Chomish and learning Chomish, they will love Yiddishkeit and be excited about it. I love seeing the excitement in my students when they are learning and that makes everything worth it. They go the extra mile to make sure the kid will be staying in, in a confidence state the entire time. 
for most of the staff, this is not a, just a job. It's a nine to four job or nine to one job. It's a lifetime. It's a day, night, giving whatever you got. And when you do that, it's a reciprocate. I think that what matters here more than any other school is that the Cheder really cares. I really feel like that's the word. We care, we care for every single child, we care for every single student. So it might be the same classes and the same lessons and the same structure of every other school, but the whole attitude of the teachers towards the students and the staff towards the head staff towards the teachers is one of, you matter to us, we care about you, we care about to see your progress, every single one of you. And because it's so small, we have the ability to do that to focus on each child. I'm so happy for my kids to have the experience of this cheder, of this love, of this devotion, of this family. So this school is a crazy amazing school. It's really fun and I really enjoy it. Like I love learning and it's very fun. And every day like I look forward, like what are we gonna learn today? What's, what's gonna be new? Like. So our general studies program really focuses on the basics, which is reading, writing, basic math. And of course, we also do a, a, you know, social studies, a study of the world. We talk a little bit about science and nature. My child in third grade opens a regular Chumash and she could just translate all the Pesachim without a notebook without. Besides the regular, you know, Chumash, Navi, Everest, you know, the regular subjects, this school in particular, I find it very impressive. They are constantly doing like school-wide projects with different themes. So whenever it's a special Chassidosh Yamtif, we want to make the students excited about it. So one of my favorite things to do is to transform the hallways. Right away when the students come into the building, they know that today is not like another day. Today is a special day. Children learn so much from their environment. Their environment is the walls that talk to them, the images that are surrounding them, the teachers that are standing in front of them. All of these are the ingredients that's transformative. My kids get up every day and they are excited to go to school. They're happy to go to school. They're excited what they're gonna learn. My kids are talking about, well, what are we gonna do today? What's the upcoming thing? What's the excitement of the week? What's the special activity? What's, there's always something happening in school and there's a smile to them. There's something that radiates. As I walk through the hallways over here, you see the school is alive. I feel like the Yiddish guy is really brought to life in this place and but it's just incredible. I think it's a real gift that we give our kids to send them to such a school. We have all these contests and ideas and ways to get the students to go out and really implement the ideas that they learn into their daily lives. I am a firm believer that we don't teach information. We teach children. When they are finish their education, what do they come out with? So we're learning the Midas. We're giving them what they need to know to take them on their own independently. We're starting at the core, at the foundation, and we're giving them the good foundation that they need to take with them. Our kids get some remedial or extra uh, attention from uh, some powers that come into the school through an agency. That agency is based in Lakewood, New Jersey. And one of the people came into the school and she goes from school to school. It's her job to see that the, the powers that are coming into the school are doing their job. And so she sat down and she came in and she's observing the classrooms. She's never been to the cheder before and she's walking around and looking and listening. And she's observing everything that they're learning in the classrooms here. And she comes back to us and she says, I want you to know that the level of education and the care and the environment is something that you will only find in those top five schools. There's 30 schools in Lakewood and she said those top five schools in Lakewood, you won't even compare, you can't even compare how good this education is. It's something unparalleled that you cannot find this elsewhere. For me as a parent to hear that yes, we are traveling an hour plus away every single day and we're putting our kids into a school that's far away and it's a drive and it's a schlep. But you know what? Sometimes we do crazy things because it's worth it. When my kids get in a car every day, yes, I know it might be an hour drive. It might be far away, but we do it because we know that at the end of the day, everything that they get out of the school is so worth it. The teachers care, the administration cares, and the friendships that they gain over here are absolutely incredible. I actually had um, a student that just transferred from here to another school. She was older and we didn't, our program doesn't continue uh, you know, for her age group. So she said to me, Morakhani, I like my new school, but I really miss Cheder. And I said, why? 
And she said, because in Cheder, everybody knows who I am. It's a family. And I miss all that love. I miss walking into a building where everybody smiles when they see me and just is there to help me, you know, to be there for me. So I feel like that's the number one thing from the Cheder, that the Cheder is not just a place to learn. It's a place where your child will be loved, where people will nurture your child and where we are all family because Hasidim are Ein Mishpacha. And that's why they go and that's why they're just excited about going. They want to come to school every day. It's a school where you wake up and everyone's just happy to be there and they're happy what they're getting out of the school. They're happy with the environment. They're happy with the extracurricular activities that go on in the school. And you can't find anything like this anywhere.